I recently watched back through some beginnings uh, of my randomizer runs, and I found out that I start them all the same way. Eh, don't mess with it. Uh, it works. So it's either uh, hello or okay, everybody. <laughs> Welcome to this week's uh, weekly seed of Secret Mono Randomizer number 95. Let's take a look at the settings. Shall we? Um, We have a Mana Tree Revival goal. Seven seeds for seven brothers. Um, vanilla bosses. Oh my gosh, vanilla bosses. So that means that the first boss in Pure Lands is going to be Dragon Worm. That's fun. Um, and we have all the um, dragons to deal with. Thunder Gigas. Who else is there? Axe Beak. Not a big deal. Um, we're starting with one character. We're finding only one other character at level one. Um, random enemy spawns. That's about it. 2-2. Two, two, normal mode. A uh, little something different now. As you can see, all of this is messed up up here. But it will be fixed soon. I have moved from tracking my stuff from uh, Emo Tracker to Pop Tracker. And now I have Auto Tracker enabled. Uh, but I'm still using the old map. Because <laughs> I like the old map that uh, Menblock made. I think Menblock made this uh, tracker. So I've got two trackers open, one of which now should be automated for all the items and everything like that. The other one is a map that I manually use, but I like. Um, I thought I turned on the controller. Hold on, I may have to reset this game. Yeah, hold on one second. I have to redo all this. Ugh. Okay, that works. So hold on. I thought I turned on the controller, but I guess not. Uh, let me double check and make sure I opened up the right thing. We're good to go. Okay. And then this needs to go away. We're starting with the boy, which we shouldn't have to mark. That's good to go. Okay, three, two, one. Bam! The boy is marked. Then it'll get unmarked. It's weird. I've tested some stuff out because I wanted to make sure that I got everything right and also all the, the spacing set up correctly. Um... The boy will get unmarked during the plummet and then get remarked once I pick up the first weapon. Which is weird. I don't understand. And also, I have no clue what all those other things were. From like a previous seed I ran, I guess? I don't know. Don't know. What it was holding on to there. Glove? Okay, what kind of glove we got? Pletus, um, invisible and, or in, it, whatever it's called, not invisible, uh, uh, intelligence, and, which I don't have, and dark damage, okay. Okay, good. Good to know. Okay. Not Luna. Not that we care about that anyway, but I'll write it down. You suck. Luna early. Dark Seed Upper Land, okay. We'll find that soon. I'll write it down anyway, just in case. Moogle belt and chest. I think we got a hundred gold, if I remember correctly. It wasn't that much.
Sylphid and Dark Seed. There it is. Okay. And look, Auto Tracker. It's just doing an, its own thing. Wow. Welcome to the fucking future. I could have done this <laughs> years ago. Oh well. You get used to something, and even if it's like a better thing, you just get stuck in your own ways, your old ways. But I still prefer the map that I have. Boomerang Orb, okay. I still need to mark off places that I visited, though. Okay. Um, chest guard, don't really care. Yeah, nothing here I'm really gonna care about. I'm just gonna get some, uh, consumables and move on. I'll write down, since we only have two people, I'll write down my Tango Tiger stuff. Since I only have two people to buy stuff for, I may, like, if this thing, if it really drags on, I may have enough money to get something like that. Fucking dude, get out of the way. Midge Mallet forgotten. Okay, I don't really care. We're gonna find that anyway. Okay, here we go. Um, ooh. Awesome. That's everything I'm gonna need for like mid game right there. Is a uh, power wrist, uh, fancy overalls, and a tiger hat. So once I get like whatever it is, like n 1925 gold, something like that. 1100 for the hat, 150, so that's 12. 1875. No, yeah, 1925. Well, let me open this. More money. Oh my gosh, I diagonal ran. It's a fucking disaster. It just killed me. Good. Okay. Uh, I, I did a, a diagonal run instead of running straight left to take a, a open route around them. Oh, well. Now I don't have to deal with that. It's just a time loss, but I don't have to, you know, deal with them again. <laughs> Fun. Okay, I'm gonna get all three chests here. Oh, go through the door, please. Oh my gosh.
Oops. Not a hugely big deal, but oops. I didn't want them to set me on fire. Oh, a, a different weapon. Okay, hold on, wait. High damage range? Fuck off. Get me out of here. <laughs> oh, this room sucks. I'm just going to reset this room. <laughs> I'm just going to reset that room. <laughs> I'm going to get silenced and lit on fire. No thanks. Not a fan. <laughs> okay, that's everything here. Neat! Don't hit me. Don't petrify me. Please don't. Man, when I find another character, it'll be great. Hey, I at least have that weapon. That's nice. That's nice indeed. Oh man, that's great. 
Ooh, okay, probably... Probably not the sprite then. I'm guessing. That is the girl with Salamando, Sylphid, and Lumina. It could be the sprite. It could just be that it's a low... You know, the, the C just rolled a, a low number of things to get in. Oh, 900 gold all. Thank you. Yeah, we are getting some stuff. We're going to go to North Town before I go do anything else. <laughs> I'm, like, not even checking other towns at this point. Because North Town is going to have all the, the shit I need. Shade! Okay, it's the Sprite exists. Interesting. Okay. So only one ally in the seed. Um, I means it's gotta be the sprite. Okay, I'm gonna get this first thing here. God. Okay. Add strength. I'll take it. Okay, well, I can go get two extra checks in Mandala now. Or the, um, Dark Palace. Oh my god. Land please, thank you. That also gives me entrance uh, to access to Undersea. Which I think I'll do after Pandora. I'll wait for that. Sprite in town. Okay. I already have that. Oh my gosh, okay. White seed, oh my gosh. Okay, Sprite's in a town. So I don't have the whip, so I can't get this fully set up. But I can get the both chests. Okay, I'm going to 
go to Northtown first. We're get, uh, it's a little bit of weird driving. We're going to go to Northtown and shop, and then we're going to go to... Um, get the, the, the hints around the, like, guys' naval area. the extra damage. Okay. We're fighting a boss. <laughs> okay. Two hints here, and then one at Potos. Or not, uh, whatever it's called. at uh, Kippa Village. A lot of running around, but whatever. Don't really need that. Not gonna bother with these shops. I'm just checking this and then we're going in. Golly, sl I mean like, so slow early game stuff. Earthseed Warm Place, ooh, okay. Well, I already know that, it's Fire Final. <laughs> Now I just need to know where the fire seat is. Okay, we're gonna do this and then go after town areas for the, um... Looking for the sprite. This is so annoying! Oh, this is so annoying. No, don't- no. oh my gosh. This sucks. I'm not even gonna check that chest. Unbelievable that I got two bursts and then that dude knocked me out and then I woke up and leveled everything up. <laughs> Come on. Gosh, this beginning has been so slow. Okay. Luckily we had, I think it was, it's a stone strength axe, so 
That went well. I honestly, forgot it was vanilla <laughs> bosses. <laughs> that money goes towards a hat. Not checking any of the shops. I feel like we've got shop info. We have a one-stop shop in uh Ugh. In Northtown. Water seed, sea hair tail, bow orb. Awesome. Well, let's clear the early area then. I think we'll do Jabberwocky first because it, it's going to be a, a more difficult boss and it has a weakness to Gnome, I believe. I think this is Stone Weapon. I could check. We know the Light Seed is on the way to the I do also have Gaia's enabled to deal with. Um Light C um is on the way to um the the ending, the the mana tree, so We'll do Undeaton's Cave after this and then do Guy's Navel. And then I think I'll go get the chest. It's Sunken Continent, but I don't know if I want to do the whole thing. I may do the first boss. Ugh, I don't know. It's it's a weird that's a weird time commitment, right? Right? I also need to do a money check to see how much I have going towards. Before and okay, definitely now. Okay, I have enough for a hat. Okay. <clears throat> There's also the possibility of like leveling up weapons at some point. Probably when I go to guys' naval. Epic music for a not very epic fight.
right, this is last healing. Couple more hits. Okay, guys, Naval. I'll get the hat later. <laughs> and I think what I'll do... is level up the... I'm afraid to lose this, this strength axe. I'm gonna leave that alone, but I'm gonna level up the gloves. Hello. Luna magic. Neat. So I'm going to need another, like, 300 gold before I leave. Fire damage. Okay. I got something else. I got a different effect. That is what I wanted. Oh, man, you... Okay, that's awesome. Okay, now they have two axe orbs. Uh, I can I can level that up kind of whenever. Okay, that's one boss, both NPCs in one chest. The other thing I want to level up the axe for, though, is uh, being able to charge it. I think that would be very helpful. A town, in a town, in a town, in a town. Wow, okay. 
Okay, I am gonna level up the axe now. Strength and Thunder. Okay. Um, gonna be great. That is great for a few of the bosses that I have to fight. Um, the Wind Dragon. Not gonna be great. Or no, Thunder Dam- wait, yeah, Thunder Damage is good for the Snake. Not good for the Wind Dragon. Not good for the, um... Uh, Thunder Gygus. But, I do have my gloves, which at least are leveled up, you know? So they may not be, uh... Okay. So all I really need is the whip and the sprite. Okay, we are hunting that sprite. Uh, in a town. <gasps> Could also be the, um, uh, whatever it's called. Oh, well, I gotta be careful now. The, um... Sea Hair Tail. Nice. Okay. Yeah, see her tail after this. Okay, um, yeah, see her tail, the North Town, to get my hat and go through North Town. I still need the whip. Nice. Actually, hold on, wait. Yeah, I can, I can get one of these. Okay. I'm 
I'm gonna check one thing. And then we're gonna do pure lands. I know that eventually I'm gonna come back and do this entire thing, but the other thing is I would like to I need to leave one. Sweet, leveled up, get all that magic back. Whip orb. I can actually, oh, no, I can't get to the final orb. Because I don't have a whip. Okay. So I won't know what it what it it is that blocks that. Okay. Got all the chests though. Okay. So we're missing the whip. Whatever. Let's go clear this shit out first. Nice. Okay. Another axe orb and money. Okay. 
Okay, I think we are set. What is this first one? Oh, the wind one, yeah. Oh no, snow, which we don't have fire. Ugh, that's fine. Okay. So we're literally, we are, we need the whip, and we need the final fire orb not to be Dryad or Salamando. Okay, there's the whip. Okay, so. We just need the final fire orb not to be Dryad or Salamando. Because we're going to find the light seed along the way, and then we go um, turn in the fire seed for the earth seed. Oh, we still need the, well, we still need the moon and the moon or the dryad seed. Fuck. Okay, never mind. We're not done. I was getting ahead of myself. We have only four seeds right now. I thought we had five. Still, I think we're on a good path. No, where are you going? We could also randomly find the moon seed or the dryad seed along the way. Um, I don't have a hint for any of that stuff. Sprite leveled up, that's what we care about. Dried magic? Okay, that's one less thing that we have to worry about going through the fire palace. So as long as it's not Salamando. Ah, what am I doing?
Um, I doubt this will work, but whatever. Nice. And the sprite survived. Okay. Does the sprite level up? Sweet. Okay, we have to fight. There's the light seed. Okay. Which we can go turn in. All right, so what is this? this? Is the wind dragon? So we should be able to blitz through them pretty easily. Okay. So, uh, the first thing, now that we have the whip, the first thing to do is go and finish the fire palace. I think that's the first thing to do and hope that we don't need Salamando. We have everything else available to us. We need it to not be Salamando. <laughs> okay, all right, okay. So, we are definitely <laughs> going to make it to the... The end of fire palace, hilarious, okay. We have access to all the things. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so we are going to Fire Palace. We turn in the Fire Seed, we get the Earth Seed. And after that, uh, we just need to start popping stuff. We need literally one seed to show up. So I think that I'm going to do the Wind Seed after that, because that's two drops. I'm going to go do the Light, go, go to Gold Tower, because that has a chest as well as two other drops at the top. Um, man, all of... Sunken continent. <laughs> I don't wanna. But that's a thing. So right now I don't really need any armor, so I'm not gonna bother with North Town. So I'm just gonna go do Fire Palace real quick. And since it's uh, Vanilla Bosses, I know that it's going to be um, the Minotaur. There's a weakness to Sylphid which I have level four right now. I don't know how to skip the, uh, oh my God. It's cool if you die, I have one. I can revive you once we get there. Luna. Okay, this will give us the Earth Seed. I'm losing my mind. Where's Sylphid? There he is. Okay, so yeah, now it's just like, we gotta get lucky. We need one seed. I have no other hints. Light seed beyond pure land bush. Earth seed is the fire final. So yeah, I just need to go out and get lucky. 
Need one seed. Okay, wind seed first, because that's two drops. Like, that's what I'm thinking about double drops. There's also LNAs, which is a long check, but could give me a, a hint. I'm also thinking about like what I spells I have. Like I have all spells now, except for Lumina. So it's also like what I've damaged for and what I've leveled up. Okay, what is the light tower? It is a spiky tiger and a minotaur. Okay, I can handle that. Blue spike and minotaur. Okay, so this is three checks right here. Wait, is it gonna bleed out? Yep, okay. Let's see if this will do it. Yeah, okay, cool. I didn't know if we uh, needed to steal magic, so. It is kind of nice not having to click over. <laughs> I've, I've dragged my, my heels way too long on this uh, auto, auto track thing. Um, where to next? Where to next? I mean, I could go turn in the Earth Palace thing. That is two checks. It's just a long way. Not what I wanted. I could also climb the mountain. Oh, man. And get hints. Mmm. I'm going to do that real quick. I'm going to climb the mountain. And then while I'm in the area, if I don't get hints about it, I'm going to... I'm not going to do doppelgangers. Just fly it out. <laughs> but...
uh, then I can go back down to the base and turn in the dark seed for two checks. So that's the game plan. Let's get these hints. Tell me where one of the seeds is, please. We're looking for the moon seed. See her tail, already got that. And a cave, the fire seed, got that. Okay, but okay, let's go turn in the dark seed. Okay, that's fine. So I'll have to run this whole loop again, because I didn't have the whip the first time. Um. Oh, no. Okay. I will leave you dead for the time being. I should have... Let me double check. Make sure I do have one... I do. Okay, I will revive you when we get to the boss. And then after this, I probably will go to North Town and shop. And, oh, do I clear stuff there? Or do I go to Earth Palace? Oh, Earth Palace is a double thing. I could, I mean, like, I could go through North Town Castle pretty quickly. But North Town Ruins sucks. Oh, come on. Y'all stop. There it is. Ugh, that was a fight. <laughs> mm. 
Did you level up? No. Okay, we need to take a nap. Moonseed, we're done. We're done! Yay. Yeah, just hit all those doubles. <laughs> Alright, some pretty some pretty cool hints along the way that gave pretty cool pathing. Um Fast seed. Oh my gosh, this could have been sub hour. Still, really fast seed. Yeah, and I didn't have to full clear the whole fucking game. What a nice turn of events for me. <laughs> All right. Sweet. Oh, excuse me. All right, first place so far. Only uh, Solar is the only other person to do something. Um, and he's got a 111. So yeah, it, it definitely came down to... I wonder if he got the hints about... Um, Earthseed... Of fire seed, fire seed leading to Earth Seed, um, because that was one thing that was Fire Seed leading to Earth Seed already had the the sprite, and then going through Pure Lands, I got all the magic, um, so I was able to like I, I had a de definitely was gonna unlock it and get that seed, um, yeah, really fast seed, yeah, could easily have been a sub hour if I had done. So I was I was chasing the the uh, sprite in a town hint. And, um, I forgot that I had the, um, sea hair tail. And if I had done that first, that would have kept me from fighting Boreal Face and saved a couple of minutes. Um, that also gave me nothing. That was another thing. That was a nothing, um, boss reward. So that's not great. Um, but yeah, I think I still would have done all these doubles. Like, it was so fast to, um, already have, like, the the light seed and turn that in like beat the beat beat both bosses get this the second level chest as well as the two chests at the t or the two um things after gorgon bull so that's three things spring beak at sprite village was two um it just made made sense to go and do all the doubles um honestly probably next and and i went and checked the hint i think you know it, the hints at uh doppelgangers or at jock and jack could have been useful that in fact they were useful hints if you didn't already have those hints those are great hints but um didn't help me we didn't have to do north town we didn't have to do underground anything <laughs> we didn't have to do uh yeah any of the stuff at sunken continent which is nice so yeah um where was the dryad sea just out of curiosity Uh, dry <laughs> Dried Seed was at, um, Triple Ton Pole. The first boss at, um, Ice Palace. So, yeah, turn in the Dark Seed or go fight Triple Ton Pole. Eh. <laughs> but yeah, finding all those other seeds just kind of along the way. Um, real, real nice. And the other thing is getting that info information early on about the, uh, um, where uh, helpful um, armor was and being able to get some money and then go back and do that all in one trip. Uh, I did go back and get stuff for the sprite. The sprite did not have a hat, but I just needed to keep the sprite alive. Luckily, it left me with a little bit of money. I was able to buy one um, couple wishes, and I was able to use that couple wishes. I never had to go to another shop. <laughs> it was nice. So that saved me some time as well that I... Um, decided not to look at any other shops. Once I found that Northtown had fancy overalls, tiger hat, like tiger crown power wrist, I was like, all right, I don't need to look anywhere else. This is my one-stop shop. And that saved me some time of not having to check. Like when I went to Goldtown, 
with the, the key for the first time. Didn't even bother checking the shop. Didn't check Kakara. Didn't check um, either Potos. Uh, well, I mean, either uh, Pandora shops. I didn't check the Dwarf Village shop. You know, so that saved me some, some time there. And also, uh, first time using the um, uh, auto tracker, which is like cheat codes. It's so nice. It's really nice. Uh, it, it took a little finagling to set up because the instructions on how to set it up are weird and poorly written, in my opinion. As somebody who doesn't understand this stuff, <laughs> it took me a minute to figure out what was going on. Um, but now that I know how to do it, it's like, oh, okay, yeah. And I understand the steps of, like, activating it and using it. Um, yeah, so, so, good seed, fun seed. Um, it wasn't... A nightmare <laughs> um, and yeah just some just some some decent hints I knew that mech 3 was nothing that total being three total elements needed for grand palace 3 was like do you have a girl or a sprite and it wasn't until the shade orb that I was like that that soon followed that I was like okay all right sprite um, but seeing that total three if it had been the girl we had Luna and um, Gnome. It would just been slower because I would have had to. I would. I think that I, before I went through Pure Lands, I would have felt obligated to level up some of the weapons, um, especially some of the long range ones like the the bow and maybe the the whip. Um, yeah, it was nice not to full clear the game. <laughs> I left a couple of continents just untouched. <laughs> it was nice. All right. Cool stuff. Well, it's, it's also nice that uh, I get to have an early night. And that's it. <laughs> there we go. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Nothing. I got no, n n nothing to close out. I was just kind of waiting for the <laughs> the music to to get to the end here. Okay, thank you so much for tuning in, hanging out, watching everything like that. It was nice not to have a nightmare. It was nice not to full clear the game. Um, fun times. Thank you so much for tuning in, hanging out, everything like that. I will see y'all here next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>